also explain to you how you use the ticket if you had two persons or more. So one person uh, takes the, the card, it is programmed, and then there are like um, gates and you have to press the card and then one person walks through and then you press the card again and the other person goes through and then you, the person with the card, walks through as last. Yeah. Sometimes I feel so stupid walking with the camera and with the photo camera, <laughs> like such a typical tourist. But that's my job as a student ambassador. So if you want to do that, keep in mind that you have to carry all the equipment around with you. As we walk through Sevilla, I see so many different um, tourist trips. So you can have a private trip, you can have bike trips, bike tours, or uh, Segway tours, or... I don't know, there's literally so many options. You can watch my video, obviously. But there's no excuse to not explore Sevilla because... And it's also not too expensive, so please explore it because there's so much to see. And I have another tip for you, so... When you're not used to those high temperatures and that the sun is shining all the time and so uh, bright and so I don't know how to explain heavily, then please use sunblock, sunblocker, especially on your face and on your shoulders and on your neck because the sun is really strong here, even if it's cloudy and um, there's wind like now, please don't underestimate the sun. We already got sunburned on our neck and shoulders, so take care of yourself. Hi everyone, so I am next to um, the Triana district um, on the west side of the river and this is because um, EUSA offered us a tour to discover Triana and we had also a guide. Um, it was in English and it was really good. Whatever, I just wanted to tell you that if the EUSA offers tours or trips like that, you definitely shouldn't miss this because it's definitely worth to join. <laughs>